duplicated OneDrive icon in Explorer. I've installed Windows 10 on a new PC, with a secondary hard disk containing my OneDrive folder, taken from my old PC. I've configured OneDrive in order to use that folder, and it's working fine. The problem is that when I open Explorer, I can see two OneDrive icons on the sidebar, both of them pointing at the same folder. How can I remove the duplicated OneDrive entry from the sidebar? According to Microsoft Forum moderator Ruiz Ray. To resolve your concern regarding duplicated OneDrive entry, follow the steps below. Search for Reget It, and then press Enter. Open Hiki underscore current underscore user backslash software backslash Microsoft backslash Windows backslash current version backslash Explorer backslash desktop backslash namespace. Check if you have several folders under namespace. If there are several folders, highlight each folder, and then check the name of the data on the right-hand side. If you see multiple folders with OneDrive as the data, right-click on it, and then select Delete. Important, this section, method, or task contains steps that tell you how to modify the registry. However, serious problems might occur if you modify the registry incorrectly. Therefore, make sure that you follow these steps carefully. For added protection, back up the registry before you modify it. Then, you can restore the registry if a problem occurs. For more information about how to back up and restore the registry, refer to the following Microsoft Knowledge Base article. How to back up and restore registry and creating a system restore point. I have another solution, since I didn't find the folder, dot 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 backslash desktop backslash namespace, in my registry. I searched the registry, using the following settings, search only by data, text OneDrive, comparing the whole string. The fourth entry I found was something like this. P underscore users backslash user ID backslash software backslash classes backslash CLS ID backslash xxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxxx